Hi, Rick Guy, the LinkedIn Guy, and in this video, I am going to demonstrate uh, the use of technology to communicate with your LinkedIn connections and uh, build relationships. So um, let me talk about these two tools. One is for Windows, the other one is for Mac. The two tools are Active Words and Text Expander. Active Words is for Windows and Text Expander is for Macs. And uh, this, these tools allow you to type an entire document with one word. So let me demonstrate it and let you see it in action. If you've been following uh, my other uh, series of videos, you know that I'm a big believer that LinkedIn um, is a dialogue tool, conversation tool, and as such, you need to take advantage of starting and continuing as many conversations as you can because that leads to building relationships and eventually it's uh, relationships is what will help you either attract more clients and or meet the people that you want to meet. So let me show you a few examples. Let's start out by looking at the people who invite you to connect. Okay, so in here I'm going to go look at uh, uh, people that are inviting me to connect. And um, so let me go take a look at this guy, Sambit, and he sent me an invitation. He has a picture, which is one of the things that I look for. And um, as I'm scrolling down, I see that he does have uh, some additional information that is good. So it seems like uh, this is someone that at least has put a little bit of effort in terms of um, building his profile. So I'm going to accept the invitation. And uh, now what I'm going to do is let me go ahead and show you this. I'm going to send them a message. Okay, so I click on send message. And what I do is I start typing. Oops, that's the wrong here. Actually, let me let me go back. I don't like this. There's a way of uh, doing this and... Uh, I don't know why it does that. I like this one better. So I start, you know, typing in thanks for the invitation to connect. Now watch this. Okay. I am going to type his name and then I'm going to type the following. Okay. The following is a message that I sent to all of my connections. And I am going to type this word L I G I F T. And I'm going to press the F8 key and look at all everything that just got typed by doing that and I'm gonna send him a message okay so that's a lot of text that I was able to send by only typing one word now you might say well you can copy and paste do the same thing yes you could but by the time you find things and copy and paste them it takes a lot longer this way it's just a lot faster so let, let, let me show you, you know, uh, and demonstrate again. If I go back to the people that send me invitations, I'm just going uh, to accept right now uh, that these people, I can always disconnect with them. But let me show you how fast I can actually do this. Okay, so I'm clicking here. I'm going to the person. And uh, I don't know, I just accept it, but I didn't do it. So I uh, just uh, re- refresh the page there it is I click on send invitation Again, I type the same thing thanks for the invitation to connect I always start out with a name that's the only thing that I type and then I type the you know my keyword and it's all gone okay so you can see it's pretty fast now let me give you a few other examples of what you can do with this okay if you go to my network and the connections tab Okay, what you'll have is you'll have uh, what happens with uh, the people that you're connected. So LinkedIn shows you who the people are that are getting a new job. Okay, so Valerie Swanson has a new job. So to say congrats, so rather than just doing the LinkedIn default congrats, I go Valerie. Okay, and I'm going to try click LI job, which is the keyword that I have. And I click, it says congratulations on new job, best wishes, is there any way I can help? comment all right so I just did that and it takes me second I can do the same thing to Holly okay so same thing I click on say congrats all right and I go Holly because I want to personalize it and L I J O B F 8 and done 
All right, so that's that. Now let me show you this, this person has happy birthday. These are all opportunities for you to start conversations. So I'll just go Derek and I'll go happy B. Okay, and then I just sent him the following message. All of these things with just the type of just one keyword. So there you have it, several examples of using active words or text expander. And it's just a very good use of technology to help you uh, streamline things, save time, and build relationships with people. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to me at the LinkedIn guy at gmail.com. Enjoy an extraordinary day. Bye-bye.